Hey y'all, it is I think 9.20 at night and we are, well I'm done, but we were trying to get everything together and ready for the trip. I still haven't decided if I'm going to use this phone case that's on my phone or if I'm going to go with this phone case. I don't know, so I'm going to take this one just in case. I don't know, I might... I might take my other phone case. I really haven't decided, y'all. I don't know what my other phone case is, and I just had it. Like, literally, just had it. It's not right here. Is it in here? I don't know if I'm going to take this one, which I'm thinking. I'm leaning towards this one, but it's so big. I don't know. All I know is I'm ready to get this show on the road. I put on another protective case. I'm going to just take both of these just in case I decide to switch it up. I put on another protective case um, on my phone because the old one needed to be swapped out. So, hold on, guys. Let me see if I can Okay. This is giving me all the time. Tokyo here, somebody. So, he doing his little I'm the master of the universe thing but yeah so very I think everybody for the most part has their stuff packed up and ready to go we're just all kind of anxious and excited so but we'll all be leaving out tomorrow so that's dope um Me and Tokyo just laying in bed. I'm at the top and I don't know if y'all can see, but Tokyo at the foot of the bed. So that's what that's what's on the agenda. We have to go pick the car up at 7:30 in the morning. So I'm gonna wake the kids up at seven so um they can get dressed, brush their teeth, wash their face, get themselves together, eat breakfast, and by the time we come back. All they need to have to do is just load the car. That's all I want. That's all we need to do is just load the trunk, get them situated in the car. This will be the first time we're taking a trip with a pet. Um, I'm gonna probably get us some, get me something to eat when I, when we go to pick up the car. But I might just have a smoothie and just wait until we get to the half point and get to Bucky's because that's when my husband's gonna swap with me and drive the rest of the way so I might just take me a smoothie for right then and then just because I got snacks like I got Funyuns popcorn a uh, little packets of like cookies um, and juices juices and teas but I'm gonna drink a smoothie before I leave so yeah Bucky got this good barbecue uh, brisket sandwich. And they got good breakfast. So, either one, I'm not losing if I get either one. So, I'm not going to even be mad. But, yeah, that's our, uh, Bucky is our, our little stop where we're going to fill up, possibly get lunch, and then finish the rest of the way because the dinner, my mom's birthday dinner, is until 6:45. There's no way I'm not gonna be I'm gonna be able to not eat all day. That's impossible. Plus, when we get there, we gotta get everybody situated, and I gotta get a shower. Hubby probably gonna take a shower, which I know he is. We all gotta get baths and get ourselves ready for the birthday dinner. But yeah, y'all, I'm breaking up. I don't know why I'm having a breakout. I need to bring my facial uh, cleansing brush with us. That's what I need to do. Because this is not cool at all. But I'm going to cleanse my face with it first in the morning before I pack it up. But, whew. Yeah, your nails. I did something for the file. It's got like a, hold on so I can focus. It's got like a Burberry 
type vibe going on. I like it anyway. I think it's really nice. I don't know why I won't focus. Duh. Let's see if I can get it. There you go. Had to tap this screen because it was tripping. But I just thought that was cute for the file. There. Now it's focused back. So, yeah. I went. I had to get my first part of the driving out the way because I knew that last stretch I was not going to want to do it. Number one, they be dropping hella fast in Dallas. And I just, I don't want to deal with it. He could deal with it. I don't want to deal with it. So. Alright, y'all. I will. Ooh, I'm, t I'm sleepy. I'm like really sleepy. I will be back in the morning. And kind of try to take y'all along the vlog. Take y'all with us to go pick up the van and stuff. We did get a van. Just because I wanted everybody to have room. Nobody to be squished and just uncomfortable. I want everybody to be comfortable. So, I really know everybody's probably going to sleep the beginning of the ride. Or towards the end of the ride. Knowing my daughter, she's going to sleep at the beginning of the ride. And because my dog see her sleep, he going to sleep. Or he might cry trying to get to me. It's going to be a problem. So, this should be interesting. Um, I know when it's time for my husband to drive, I might either have to get in the back seat with Tokyo or allow Tokyo to come up there with us in the front seat. I don't know. We'll see. Because it's just the first time we've ever ridden, rode with a pet. And he is really spoiled to the point he cries because he can't get to me when I'm driving. So, yeah. Oh, look. Look. Why? Why are you here? Who sent you? So, yeah. My girl Erica braided my hair up today. Because I get it braided every two months. So, <gasps> for my wig. Because I'm not allowed to have braids during the winter time. So, yeah. Alright y'all, I'm finna get out of here. I just realized that I need to put my throw blanket on my suitcase. And I need to pack these and something else I need to do. I just can't remember. So, I will see y'all in the morning. I want everybody to get a look at this. This is my mama dog, Raindrop. Do you see this big old dog? This is my little precious small tater tot. <laughs> You see this brisket and this tater tot? It's a brisket and it's a tater tot. It's a brisket and a tater tot. Tell them, look at the camera and tell the people you got a tater a brisket. It's my birthday. Oh yeah, let me show y'all what she cooks. So we got chicken, dirty rice, green beans. Uh, don't tell me. Smothered corn, greens, and ribs, and mac and cheese. If your mama don't cook, I don't know what to tell you. My mama cook. Oh, you got big apples. Oh, and she made candy apples. Chocolate covered candy apples. That is. Cornbread. Can you look cute? Right? I'd date you. With I'd marry you. Mm -hmm. Look good, you girl. Say I what? Her face <laughs> is brown. She's so pretty. Y'all like my cups? Oh, y'all know my mama make cups. I showed y'all the cups she made for me. She made the shirt too. Mm-hmm. So if y'all want cups and shirts, I'm gonna put my mama information in the description box. Y'all need to hit her up. Don't ask for no freebies because we don't do freebies here. <laughs> All right. Say hey, Audrey. You know, I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Not do my people like that. <laughs> so in a few, I guess Ranger could stay here with Audrey. They don't have to be separated. Yeah, mama, yeah. Grandma? I don't think they gotta be separated. Who is that? That's my husband, y'all. <laughs> They can't do good. 
Yeah, I'm finna show me. Yeah. No, I do not have no hair on because as soon as I got some on my house, I took my wig out. My hair over there. What? Who gonna, who gonna pop me? <laughs> who? You wanna see me? At work? I don't know. I don't think he's coming because he's all on the way. <laughs> Tifa says she's not, she not bringing the keys, so. But yeah, we're taking my mama to dinner. It, our reservations are for 645. She got this kitchen smelling so good. I'm still trying to figure out why. See, if I want to open my big mouth, we'd be eating dinner right here, right now. But I did. No, ain't gonna be no leftovers there, honey. Huh? Yep, going to be Chris. So, yeah. Oh, look, babe. All right, y'all. Hey, y'all. So, I'm sitting here, and I just realized that okay so i realized two things one i realized that it's 5 37 and i'm not supposed to be eating at the six because i'm supposed to be trying this intermittent fasting the second thing i realized okay i realized a couple of things the second thing i realized that i'm not i can't do intermittent fasting i can't do it okay let me fix it it's not that i can't do it i don't want to do it this is what I feel like. I feel like as long as I am responsible about what I put in my body, as far as food and stuff, I should be okay. So, you know, I'm slowly but surely I'm taking little steps to start getting myself ready. Um, One of the things I've done is I bought me a little refrigerator for my room. Because I drink the the little boat form smoothies and I like to have certain fruits. And if I don't separate my stuff from their stuff, they'll eat my stuff along with their stuff. So my refrigerator has a freezer, a produce thing, and um, um, a freezer, a produce thing, and places where you can put like food and stuff. So I have that and I have all my juices and stuff. Mainly because this weekend, I'm doing a lot of juicing. Won't be really eating anything. I'll probably have a salad. Like, I might bake me or saute me some some fish and do a salad for dinner. But I'm going to be juicing a lot um, for breakfast and lunch. So, there won't be... Um, and I, I think I need to go pick up me some fruit because I can have fruit in between. But I won't be eating any meat or anything. Like, I, I'll be detoxing my body this weekend. Um, another thing is that I need to get back into the habit of working out because I have not been working out, y'all. I have gotten lazy. And there's no reason why I can't work out right now. I'm just not. I've gotten lazy and I've gotten comfortable and that's not good. The next, cause you see, this is not, no, this is not a double chin. Cause I know you're looking like, don't you have the double chin? No, this is the symptoms to my, uh, to the sarcoids. It left scarring. Um, and if you don't know what scar, sarcoids is, look it up. Um, another thing I'm sitting here, I have a pulmonary appointment tomorrow and I'm sitting here. And I have not gotten my clothes out. I have not gotten my hair out. I don't know what I'm wearing tomorrow. But I'm sitting here doing nothing when I could be doing that. That's crazy. That's crazy. I did do something productive today, though. I went to the grocery store and I got my smoothies and stuff. I got my stuff to make my salads for the next couple of days. I'm actually, I don't know if hubby wants me to make them tonight, but if I don't make them tonight, I'm definitely going to make them tomorrow. But I'm making black bean quesadillas. So I'm taking steps to eat better and, you know, be more cautious of what I eat and how I put food in my body. But I'm supposed to be making black bean quesadillas. Um, another thing is, 
I need to do some stuff with my plant. Y'all, I'm sitting here doing nothing when I could be doing a whole lot of something. That is my point. I what is this under my nails? Cake icing is under my nails. Oh my god. No, that's not even cake icing. I don't even know what that was. I thought it was icing, but it's not. I don't even know what that was. But the point is, I'm sitting here. I'm doing absolutely nothing when there's so many things that I could be doing right now, this instant. So, I'm going to take you guys with me as I'm laying in my bed, doing nothing, being comfortable. I'm going to be uncomfortable for a second. And I'm going to go in my closet and I'm going to find something to wear. I don't want to be too dressy because I'm ripping and running with my children tomorrow. And there's just no, and we're doing a lot of doctor's appointments and stuff and social security card getting and things like that. So I don't want to be overly dressed, but I don't want to be underdressed to where I don't look presentable. You know what I mean? I don't want to wear tights tomorrow. I would prefer to wear jeans. Do I feel like wearing a dress? I don't think I feel like wearing a dress. I don't think I want to. I think I want to wear some jeans. I think I want to wear it. Get out of here, Tope. I think I want to wear some jeans and some tennis shoes. So, let's see. Get out of that closet, Tope. So first off, I don't want to be too dolled up, D out. Don't go, see, you're not going to be satisfied to close the door to the closet. Okay, so let's see what I got. I'm going to pick out a pair of jeans. Utilize those jeans. I think I'm going to wear this pair. Simple, cute. I think I'm going to wear that pair of jeans. Find me a top. Let me find a top that I currently something's not right. I knew it wasn't right. I felt it. What is this? A jumper. Yeah, I'm purging my closet slowly but surely. So let's go over here and find a I'm gonna sit you guys right here. I'm going to find a let me move my wig stand out the way find a shirt that I can wear that I have not worn I think this is too dressy this is cute but this would be cute with this would be cute with dark denim and some slides so let's rethink this wardrobe because I can still be cute and I don't recall wearing this top but I really want to wear those jeans so let's see I could wear those jeans with this shirt. At this point, with some cute, I can wear this shirt with some cute red, I don't know who this is. With some cute red sandals and those jeans and call it a day and do a half tucked in, tucked out situation. And that'll be really, really cute. <sighs> or, let's see. What's this? That's a cute little top, but I don't want to wear it. That's a cute top. What's this? Don't want to wear it. Like, I'm looking at stuff with tags all over it that I have not worn. I don't want to wear it. Don't want to wear it. You gotta like, girl, find something and sit down. Okay. So, definitely gonna wear this shirt tomorrow with those jeans. Now that we find, found that portion of my outfit, I need to find some shoes. See, because if I lay my stuff out, then I can't say I wasn't prepared, because I was. I want to do a sandal. Definitely don't want to do a booty. Get out, Tope. But what kind of sandal? Do I want to do a slide sandal? Or do I want to do a sandal sandal? 
out toke. Cause I could do a simple black slide. Get out of here. Thank you. He's so hard headed. Out. I don't think I have a red slide. Oh, I do. Second way. These red slides. Bam. Outfit coming along. All because I'm pushing myself to move. <sighs> okay. Alright. Because I have decided that I'm going to be wearing clothes. Hold on, guys. Okay, sorry. That was my keys, doctor. Okay, so now that I have a idea of my outfit, my shoes, I need to find a purse. I think I'm going to do my red coach bag because I have not wore this yet. Okay, so now we're getting somewhere. And I'll decide my perfumes in the morning because that determines my mood. Like, I have an idea of what I'm going to spray on my body tomorrow. What is this? I hate when my husband just throws stuff on my little area. Okay, so we're throwing this away. Alright, oh, and this is the refrigerator I was telling you guys about. Y'all gotta excuse my husband. Oh, and these are clothes that I'm donating, actually. I gotta drop them off tomorrow. But that is my that is my little refrigerator. And it has stuff on the doors as well. Okay, let's see. Um take you in here. Cause now I need to find my hair. <sighs> yeah, I'm so unorganized. I got a lot of stuff in a lot of places. A lot of stuff. Okay, so what kind of hair? I don't want hair that's a fuss, but I also need to wear some, my synthetic wigs because I'm now into human hair wigs, but I still have a lot of synthetic hair wigs. So I need to decide what synthetic hair wig I'm gonna wear. So I'm gonna sit y'all right here. And I'm going to go in this little chest I got. I'm going to pick one of these wigs out of here. That I've got in here. This will be perfect. Do I have to cut the lights to this? Let's see. I think I already wore this. So I shouldn't have to cut the lights. Nope. Don't have to cut the lights. Don't have to do nothing. Just put the hair on. That would be perfect tomorrow. So I'm going to wear my baby hair wig. It's a long wig. Long hair synthetic wig. And it has pretty curls in it. So that is my hair for tomorrow. Hey, give me that. You need to stay out of that bathroom. All in a trash can. That been a nasty one. Okay. Got my hair. Got my clothes. Um, what else I need? Hair, clothes. I'm not doing really no makeup. Because... With the pulmonary test, you're going to have stuff all on your face. The most I might do is some mascara. And I might hide this blemish just a little bit. But other than that, I'm not doing no makeup. Um, what else? Yeah. That is it. See, with you guys, I got up. I did something that was productive. And that is just part of moving and, and taking care of business. Stop eating on my, you know not to eat on my pants. Move. That's just part of being productive. Because had I would have sat there, I would have waited until the last minute tonight to get my stuff together. Nothing would have been done. I would have been tired, wanting to get to bed, so I would have rushed through everything. So now I feel good. So the moral of this story is, because y'all know it's a moral, do not put off what you can do right then for later take care of it then right then and there so you won't have to worry about it later look at him being a bad boy you gonna show the people how you acting show the people how you acting you mad are you mad sweet boy sweet boy okay so i'm gonna get out of here because clearly toki wants time um don't chew mommy shirt bless you stop biting me stop biting me Anyway, I'm about to finish doing what I said I was going to do. I am going to do some stuff to my planner that I need to do. I'm going to plan my day out tomorrow because the doctor just 
my kids doctors just called me and told me that they are not going to be able to put their appointments together they're going to have to be separate um and i am going to set my purse up and decide what lippy i'm going to wear after i leave which will probably be some lip gloss because i just don't want to wear a lot of makeup tomorrow i think it should just be me covering this flaw throwing i don't have to do nothing to my brows y'all know them natural and just doing my eyelashes in a lip gloss and calling it a day because god and my mama and my daddy gave me this these features at 39 she's pretty um so yeah i'm gonna get out of here finish getting this together i needed you guys to motivate me i need you guys to push me i need you guys to hold me accountable to get off my behind and do something productive and that is what i'm gonna get ready to get up and do so i thank you guys so so much let me get busy bye